The world is changing fast, globalisation, automation, and that's changing the world of work for young people and, and older people. But young people coming into this system, I guess, ha have the most skin in the game of, of these changes because they've got their whole working lives ahead of them. And we're, we're, we're in, a, in a world where there's many other countries investing in education, thinking about these changes, thinking about their, their workforces. So that's the kind of, kind of competition we, we have to acknowledge, that, that it's, a, it's a global world and a, and a global labour market for more and more things. But the, the, real, the real effects of these changes, I think, are, are felt in, in people's everyday lives. It's about being able to get up in the morning and feel that you're, you're building on where you were yesterday, that you're building up that sense of security. And it's not just financial, it's, it's all kinds of senses of security around your life going somewhere that becomes harder if we, if we don't think very, very carefully about how we provide pathways for, for young people in work, but also collectively how we work together to make sure that people don't fall through the cracks and that we look after people who, who maybe in this fast changing world don't have a lucky break, don't get those opportunities. Those are the kind of things we have to do if we're going to make sure that not only are we globally competitive, but we're, we're the kind of society that we want to be.